Good afternoon and good morning, depending on which corner of the world you are. Uh, my name is Morgan Alexander, and I'm the uh, composer and pianist with whom we've been in touch for the past few weeks or the past few months. Uh, and uh, I must say that I've been living with your works. Uh, I've been projecting them in my studio. I've been studying them, dissecting them, decoding them. And uh, now I feel that uh, because I've been amongst them so much, I feel that they just have created this uh, unison structure uh, that sometimes I find it difficult to uh, separate but of course without taking away from uh, each artworks uh, individuality as well as uh, each artist's individuality. Uh, tonight is going to be uh, a very unique um, uh, event because for the fact that we're going to have a troupe of artists which uh, are uh, belong to a variety of genres uh, such as abstractionists, poets, uh, photographers, sculptors, and um, it's, uh, it's never happened that I've come across such a thing. Uh, a lot of the artists have decided to uh, share personal details, which are, uh, it's, it's quite brave and uh, quite helpful when, when it comes to the, uh, uh, to the second level of uh, an event structure. Uh, but of course, it comes to the help of um, the creators in order to give more insight and light and uh, I'm really thrilled uh, to be diving in, into uh, the narration and um, the creative process of uh, music exhibition. Rhonda Sorrells, or uh, Rhonda Sorrells, is, uh, is an artist uh, based in uh, Northwest Indiana, uh, where she uh, lives among, in a little farm with goats and chickens. Um, I came across this beautiful, almost a divine landscape uh, called Wide Open. Uh, it came to my eyes as, a, as an ensemble of colors so clearly and, and so sweetly, I would say, uh, that no other landscape has come across this way. Uh, and that is simply for the fact that the work appears to have such a smooth texture. And I want to know more about your technique. You know, I almost feel as if I'm there to witness your stroke on the tableau as you elegantly painted. Uh, but furthermore, I, I love the details of the sky. It's it's it appears as as um, elastic as the water, you know. And uh, it's 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 a work of passion, and I could tell the link, the strong link that you have, that connection with the place, with the environment where you live. Um, I will say a few words before we transition to the music. Uh, Rhonda says that I painted this piece as an invitation, the weather or warmth of the uh, barn says to come explore its hidden depths for a little while. Then the endless blue sky and the wide open expanse invite us to continue our journey, calling us to something deeper, an exploration of the need to belong to something greater and bigger than ourselves, a new horizon.
Dear Rhonda, thank you. Uh, as I said again, it's, uh, it's a very divine work. I am uh, I'm truly captivated by it to the core, and uh, the more I look at it, the bigger it seems. Uh, I would also love to, uh, to visit this place and uh, to try to make the connection, the magical connection between, uh, between the place itself, uh, the music and the painting, and the feeling that it really uh, conveys to you. Thank you, thank you.